So um, let's just look at um, example 37. Example 37 says, the table below shows corresponding values of B and H, given that H varies inversely as B, calculate the values of M and N. So here's how I would start out. Um, step one of the four steps of a variation what? Um, question says, you must translate the variation statement into a variation equation. The variation statement here is that H varies inversely as B. Now, step one, because the word use is inversely, it's going to be what? H is equal to K divided by B, where K is the what? Um, constant of proportionality or the proportionality constant or the variation constant. The two variables are H and what? And B. If the word used was directly, it would be K multiplied by. If the word used is inversely, it is k divided by. That is step one. Step two, you're going to be given a value of, let's go to page two for the next page for step two. Step two. All right, so step one, we have h, h is equal to k over b. We have our table B, H, 5, 14, 7, um, M, N, 35. That is our table. Step two, I must be given a value of B and H, corresponding values of B and H so that I can calculate K. So using this, when B is equal to 5, H is equal to 14. I'm going to have 14 is equal to K over B, which is 5. If I have one fraction is equal to one fraction, what must I do? Cross multiply. Very good. So 1 times K is K is equal to 5 times 14, which, if I'm not mistaken, is 17. So K is equal to 70. Step two, you are given a value of B and H so that you can calculate K. Step three, rewrite the equation and put in the new value for K. So H is equal to K, which is um, 70 over B. Step four, you're either going to be given a value of B to find H or a value of H to find B. Notice this, when B is equal to seven, um, H is equal to M. So here I'm given a value of what? I'm given a value of B to find a value of H. So let's put them in, M is H is equal to 70 over B, which is seven. 70 divided by seven is 10. So M is 10. Rewrite the equation. H is equal to 70 over B. All right, so next we need to find N. I'm gonna say when X is equal to, sorry, not X, when B, when B is equal to N, H is equal to 35. Put that in so that we can find N. We're going to get what? H, which is what? 35 is equal to what? 70 over N over B, which is N. If I have one fraction is equal to one fraction, what must I do? Cross multiply. So 35 times N is 35 N is equal to one times 70, which is 70. Divide both sides by 35. 
and I get n is equal to two. Two. So, ladies and gentlemen, b is equal to sorry, m is equal to ten, and n is equal to two. All right, the four steps are before you. These are the four steps that I took. Um, um, and this is the first question that we're doing, where um, it's, a, it's the first inverse variation question. All right, so the next one is going to be an inverse variation question. And that one I'm going to ask you to do on your own. So make your notes, everybody.